Hello everybody, welcome back to Super Mario Galaxy. Last time, we defeated Melty Molten Galaxy in surprisingly a very much quicker quick amount of time. This time, however, we're going to go through all the secret Lu the Luma missions. Learn that, let's grab ourselves our five one-ups. Well, thank you Princess Peach, thank you Toad. You have a lot more lives than really kind of think of. But hey, I thought I had a little bit. Other than that, actually, if we went to the Terrence first, which I'll definitely show you in particular, this is how many actually Luma Star Drakes we have. Oh, of course, here's the map. <laughs> As I see right there, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight secret stars. Shouldn't, do, shouldn't be too bad. I mean, how hard could it really a lot of these really be anyway? Let's go to the sweet, sweet galaxy. Okay, then. All right, <laughs> sweet, sweet galaxies first. Boom. Let's <laughs> enter the po into the portal. Rocky Road. Now, these stars honestly don't really matter too much. They're just like I mean, they do kind of matter for a hundred percent. But when I say this is definitely not if it's one of those easier. These definitely not that great art, art of mission. I mean, actually not. So it's definitely reasonably difficult, especially with the holes. Or if I actually somehow end up getting shocked, it would basically be kind of screwed in the end. Other than that. <laughs> Shit. Okay, you know what? I launched a little bit wrong. Okay, well, conveniently, if we respawn. Oh, shit. Perfect. We're on the final part of the, f the level. Ah, you know what? A decent mission. I mean, is it really gonna be that much? Really, like, is it really gonna be that difficult of a mission anyway? Not really. Just gotta avoid, you know, like, going through the holes. <laughs> well, so one thing, we are probably gonna be teleporting right back to the spawn area. So, there's probably gonna be a lot of, you know, cuts to... Basically, get all the way back to each... Each Luma. A very sick of speech. Alright. I believe this is the. Oh yes, this one I remember. Still, actually, not much of a problem. I mean, not literally in the literal sense. Cause you're just kind of swing, sling yourself, avoiding the obstacles. Or if you're Nate like me, you ended up actually kind of missing it, of course. Yeah, it's always a simpler. It's yeah, yeah. No, I do really well against the Fairy Dino Prof boss fight, or like, it's like that. But I struggle with going through like basic, you know, like aiming challenges. Oh, 
I struggle, I struggle, I struggle with the basic aim challenges. Yep, nope, of course, and I can't even... Yeah, I struggle, uh, of course. I mean, this is also probably also the best minigame as well. I should definitely grind yourself up to, like, 999 star bits. If need be. But... I don't really need much star bits anyway. I'll take him for the extra life ability. Now we get to the sling star part. Luckily, it's also where you'll probably go for. Oh. What? No! How did it. Somebody, we saw, please hope we. I respawn up there. Okay, I do. Good. No. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, we had a time this was right. Now. And for it. Now. Now we're in the star. <laughs> I got it. Luckily, the star's hitbox on those kind of missions, I believe, actually are slightly larger, I think. I don't know for sure. Okay. Time for some more Luma tracking. Big Mouse Gold Bait. Alright. No, we do not. That's good. Oh. Yep. This is my hideaway. It's, it's, the, it's the perfect spot for fishing being left alone. Don't know what's... Just only for the shell at signs. Oh, okay. So we actually just need a golden shell. Okay. I really need to fight those guys anyway. They're not a threat. But now we need ourselves a golden shell.
Oh, how do you? I forgot this is underwater stage. We all know underwater physics. Smart Galaxy. Honestly, suck. I've said I think I should really kind of enjoy Smart Odyssey's physics in terms of underwater. Alright, there we go. Monster in the middle. Or, slings down in the middle. Okay, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Oh, we can't even hit those, okay. Those boos honestly no threat, and if anything, despite this being what I would call a underwater mission, that's a note. Man, man, that was close. Oh, Mario, I was about to tell you something. I was trying to get a star, but I found this treasure chest. Let me tell you, it's even smaller than it looks. Anyway, here's a star I found in there. No, really, it's yours. Okay, well, that's a comedic way to actually find you. I, I mean, take the star power star. <laughs> yep. I would say it is definitely nice to use it to see Captain Toad, at the very least, having a lot of use. It's a very useful, like, ally. Next up, I believe actually the last one of these uh, Illuma stars is by far the worst, which in fact is the bunny one, Sand Snow Bunny. Oh, oh, this one I've heard about this one. I've never done this one before. We have a choice to choose between one of two power-ups. This white mushroom is yummy! <laughs> These yellow mushrooms are super delicious. Um, not like I've been sitting here all day eating them. Alright. Well, we have a choice to choose for different power-ups. We have the Boo power-up, or also the B power-up. From what I kind of see, 
it looks like the bee put mushroom might not be as effective. So I'm gonna probably go with the boo mushroom. Heard about the bee mushroom having the problems of well, bee mushroom having the problems of the lights, while bee mushroom have while bee Mario will have basically <laughs> it's bright because of the moonlight. Oh wait, what do we even have to do? We have to run this entire length all the way around. Okay. Oh shit! We're gonna okay. We have to kind of time just right a little bit. Be a little bit of timing, unless we actually were able to, unless we actually could jump towards the middle. I think. Is it even possible to make it there? No, we probably couldn't make it. Shit. Okay. Okay, let's see. How am I supposed to do this one? Oh, how do you... Come on. Of course. Nintendo Wii controls. Oh shit. Oh come on. We're losing our lives here, okay? You're kidding me. Really? Can I just jump towards the moon anyway? Oh, can I even jump towards the moon? No, oh, wait. Yeah, you, you can. Okay. Well, I'm foolish wasting my time trying to go around the entire area when you could do, literally just jump right towards the middle for the impossible. Well, <laughs> I 
it's still, I would say the, I say the first part of mission doesn't really matter what you choose. As for the last part, it's only really difficult, basically because of just that one little final section. That's the only reason why that level in particular is honestly kind of frustrating. Race and Spooky Speedster. Alright. It looks like a rematch. Oh. There's nothing over here. Oh, there's nothing here. Hmm. What's into the pipe? Hey, the name's Dillboard. Listen, you remember how to move around as Boo? Okay, well... Hehe, <laughs> <laughs> so you're after it too. You'll have to race me for it. Hehe, <laughs> here we- here we go! No, boo! Hey! Mario! We got it! We- We won! Hee hee hee! Zero- Zero, zero minutes, fifty three seconds, seventy milliseconds. Well, the promise is a promise, so take the star! Hey, Mario! Hey, Mario! Hey, Mario! Hey, Mario! Hey, Mario! Honestly? Take it already! I still- I still kinda wish you could actually just like, grab the star and still be in the power-up form. Cause that'd be really cool. But hey, uh, surprisingly enough, a really decent, really decently paced mission. Now after this I'll probably do, be doing the trial galaxies, which when I say, are going to be a nightmare. Complete nightmare. Star Bunny is in the snow. <sighs> what I mean to say is, yes, this mission, if anything, is honestly good, is by far the worst compared to Star Bunny missions. Yes. If you think this mission was, the reason why this mission is so bad. It's because of the, the fact that you're also going to have to go ahead and get rid of... Okay, let's play Chase! Can you catch all of us before the time runs out, boing? Yeah. I'm <laughs> 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 Okay, I can't be. 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 I
almost enough. Plus, plus, plus. Every time we fail. Let's just get another spot. Quickly. Final spots. Push it. Move that. Definitely was not an easy mission, but hey, no doubt about it. I believe that she's not actually figured out where the last the bunnies were. I was able to beat it, like at least finally, which is definitely was kind of nice, a little change of pace. But <laughs> that is all for the Hunger with Stars. Next up, we're getting started with the Trial Galaxies. Now I'll probably separate all those galaxies into three parts because no doubt about it. They're gonna be brutal. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and I will see you all in the next time.